I need a bitch that rock Louis V like me My talent times two like I'm Siamese Put money in my pocket till it rip my jeans I'm cold ice cream I told my team Ain't nobody fucking with us that's on Hey what's up guys Um Odar here And today I'm just gonna make a video for you guys I know I haven't made one in a while I, I just thought I'd make one Uh This is uh as many of you may know, you may have used it, you may not have, but um, I made a video on how to activate Windows 7, so um, I'm just going to be here just to show you how to activate Windows 8 since I just installed it, so I already have mine activated, but I'm just going to show you the, she the steps, and like always, I'll have the link to the program in the description, but uh, what, I'm just going to show you right here what version of Windows I have, give me one second. I have the Windows 8 Professional, um, no media center, none of that. So, all right, what you're going to do, you're going to download the program in the description. It's called Activator. Um, what it does, basically, it's essentially, as it says, it's an activator for Windows 8, and it also has a bunch of useful tools in it. So, uh, just run it. And uh, also, if you're still on Windows 7 and don't need to, um, and you don't need to do any of the, uh, or if you haven't installed it yet and you're stuck on the screen where it says, uh, like, enter in the serial number to install, um, I'll put a uh, serial number that you can use down in the description. Um, just use that serial until you fully active, or until you get onto it so that you can activate it using this. And just wait for it to load. Oh no, I, um, yeah, no, I was lying, but, um, I don't know when it installs this, but right here, uh, as you can see, I don't know where it is exactly. It's in program files, I think. No, it's just in windows. I think it copies it right here just so it's, uh, always on your computer so you can always use it. But, um, it's going to be with all these question marks and everything because it's in Korean. I think it is just click English. Yeah, I was right. It's in Korean. Just click English, and then you'll see the what it actually says. Um, if you don't want to go through the hassle of all this stuff, like with the entering in all the the OEM information and stuff like that, just go to beginner mode. Uh, choose your version of Windows. Yes, this can activate other versions. Like Windows Seven will most likely open Windows Loader, but um, like what I used in my Windows 7 video, but what you're going to do, just hit Windows 8 plus Windows Server 2012, install pirate activation. It's going to go through some uh, command prompts on your screen, and then I'm not going to install it since I already have my, um, have everything activated, but like I said, what you're going to do is just click on that, it'll go through some command prompts, just let it do it, and then at one point it will say, um, it'll state one thing on a command prompt, just let it finish, once it finishes, um, it will log you out and then reboot you, so once you get back in, it'll go through some more command prompts, that, that one's only going to take like a couple seconds though, and then, um, then you'll be activated. You look at, uh, and then you can also remove it. I don't know why you'd want to, but just in case you get like a legit activation key or something like that. But um, it's also for the Media Center edition of Windows 8. And then uh, you could get the classic UI, set, uh, Windows 7 style. And also, um, I know I was just going to show you how to activate it. That is how you activate it, but um, there's just some cool tricks. And you can also just press that right there to go directly to Windows 8. But um, there's also utilities in here for the registry workshop. You can, um, the OEM logo, you can remove that. A uh, screen to EXE is like a screenshot into a executable. Ultra ISO is so you can burn uh, whatever you would ever need to burn. Uh, HD tune, I haven't really used this yet. It's just basically essentially just tools for your computer and stuff like that but um as you just saw in there like also with dual boot uh, dual boot pro you're going to see that it has like a uh, korean language well it's not it's not going to show korean it's just going to say all those question marks again i shouldn't have opened that
all right well uh but that's about it there's some more tweaks in here you can mess around with it yourselves uh temporary cleaner i haven't figured out what it is it just installs some files uh, sorry i didn't mean to open that all right and uh yeah but that's about it that's how you activate windows 8 and um just to show you that it is fully activated I don't know why I keep doing that. I'm used to Windows 7. I'm going to go back to system. Okay. Oh, there it is. All right. It says Windows is activated. I'm going to click on it and just show you the details. Windows is activated. Windows 8 Professional. It's uh, fully activated. And also in here, it has a tool in advanced mode for the activation check right here. Online activation check. It will just um, check your system to see if it's activated. Uh, this is to show you that it's a uh, genuine um, oh it's not supported whatever but um, anyway you get the point offline activation check will just open up a window saying like uh, if you're activated or not and yeah see uh, software license running that Windows professional edition it's just gonna show you a bunch of stuff and yeah so that's how you activate Windows 8. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to subscribe, and um, I'll bring you guys some more videos soon. All right, peace.